Hey, what's going on? Welcome to Digi X3. This is Jamal over in Philly. We're going to teach our guys how to do some tricks today. And one of the tricks we're going to do, we're going to go inside Cody. But before we go inside Cody, we're going to walk around a few spots on the outskirts. And what we're going to talk about over here is your Android market. If you want to go in there and get Facebook, motor racing, um, Instagram, or any type of game from the Android market, you're allowed to do so. The next is your web browser to surf the web. You can jump on the web. That's a real world web. The next over here, this is your file manager. Also, this is critical. It's your over-the-air update, the OTA. Um, also, this is ULA to test your speed. And then down here is quick support. We can get support. And then also you have a YouTube and you can add more icons. When I press on that plus, I can put more different things inside there. So what I'm going to put inside here, I'm going to put Skype inside here. Also, I'm going to put inside here, film on. And I might put maybe email or file browser in there. Make it more simple. And I come back up, I fold it up. All right, so next what we're going to do is now change the date and time. So we're going to check on the weather first. I'm over here in Philadelphia. So we're going to tap on that. Go back over. All right, pressing Philadelphia real quick. All right. Come down, press that, confirm. Got it in Philly. That should change up. Then I'm going to go into settings, go to other, go to more settings, come on down to date and time. I'm looking for Eastern time zone. Select on Eastern time zone and that should set me up. I think I should be okay. And then now we want to go into Cody Media Center. That's where all the movies at. Press on Cody. Now, once you come inside Cody, this is how the interface will look. We got a whole new interfacer. And if we look, they got everything categorized. And if you look, we got a bonus TV, got an EPG, Gorilla Streams. You can press on these. These are actually applications. So I can press on Gorilla Streams. D plays pretty much on good um, live TV. Then I can come over to Live TV, click on that. This is actually some Live TV. And as we can look, we got a whole bunch of things going on. So this is actually a, a super Live TV tab. So we can actually click on that as well. So those those two right here. And then we got World TV down the bottom. Anybody want to get some World TV? We can press on that. And then it's a library right here. They got a library set up. And then when I go back up, I go to TV shows, right? And then I can go all the way down the bottom, okay? And this right here, these are all actually applications, if you're looking at right here. These are applications. So you want to make sure you go inside all the applications. They go TV shows over here, TV for me, go TV, TV, and also Showbox. And um, anybody know about Showbox? Showbox is another place where you can get a bunch of movies and a bunch of TV shows. So I'm going to tap on Showbox, okay? And I'm going to real fast search on some movies real quick. And all right, and just for example, if we look for Ride Along, the new Ride Along 2 is in there. So Ride, okay? And that's the new one with Ice Cube, and I don't believe it's out yet. And we had access to it already. Okay. And I'm going to come down here and search for it. And voila, we have Ride right Along 2. So don't the movie app I'm using is called Showbox. So it's the guy with the eye down here. Okay. And the rest of these, the Giddy Up Network is a good way to watch some TV shows and a classic cinema for older TV shows. All right. And then I'm going to go back up here for movies. And then we go for movies, we got Genesis, Salt Movies, Rock Crusher Movies, Cinema XL, Online Movie Pro, and Stream Movies. And I'm believing what they did was they put the top movies up here. 
Sky Movie, Movie K. And if I keep on going over to my right, we get access to more movies. So when I come down here, right, and look, these are some more movie application down the body. So don't get these two confused. These are movie apps and these are movie apps as well. This is a whole new interface that they put out. And I'm going to tap on a popular movie app called Phoenix. And don't sleep, don't sleep on the other movie apps because they all mean something. But I'm going to tap on Phoenix. I'm going to go to Still 2014. I'm going to press on 2015, 2015 HE Movies. And as you can see, he has a lot of new stuff inside here. Okay, there's a lot of new movies up here. They ain't the all HD clear, crystal clear. So he kind of setting a good name for himself. And then when I come out, I'm gonna come back out of still. That's with the Rock Waller. And I'm gonna press on Rock Crusher and hit on Rock Crusher. And he has some current movies and new 2015 HD movies and current movies. Okay, so you got a good selection going on as well from the Rock Crusher. And then also, don't forget to check out um, 124215 on the top. And don't forget to check out TMB. And you can look into these ones over here, Finman FM, and different things as well. And I'm going to come out of here, and then I'm going to go over to IPTV. And these are all TV, these are all live TV. Anytime you see IPTV, that stands for live television. Channel Pairs, Live TV, All Streams, Fubar, Project Cypher TV, and so on. Um, if I keep on pressing over to my right, we have some more Live TV. And then we go to Sports. The two main sport applications that you're going to be using the most is going to be Dragon Streams and Sport Devil, from my knowledge. Um, you guys can go into Money Sports and check in here and Operation Robocop and stuff like that. You got an NBA Full Games, NFL Replay, NHL On Demand. I'm just going to trust on Dragon Streams real fast. Get your guys to know how to mess with this. That's the green dragon down the bottom. And then get your guys a little logistic on how to actually play this real quick. And I'm going to Dragon, Dragon Sport. Click on Dragon Sport. I'm going to show you guys the difference between um, Dragon Streams while we inside here. I pressed on Dragon Sport. And then we got Live Fight 1 and we got NFL. So I'm going to click on NFL since it's NFL season right now currently. And then we might we can go ahead and watch a whole bunch of NFL games. So I'm going to go to Dragon List. And he got something called Scrap List. Some of these scrapped together and put together. But I took Dragon List. You can just look at the processor, how the processor works on the bottom right-hand corner. And these are all the NFL games that he have currently. Okay? Um, these are all the currently games. at the red zone up here. He has a Green Bay, Arizona, uh, some Seattle, St. Louis versus Seattle, New York Giants, and Minnesota, and so on. And they crystal clear. And he had Jacksonville, New Orleans, and so on. And I, t I tell you, the, all the games in here are crystal clear. Um, just be patient and go through your links. And uh, one of the links should work in the following instructions. I'm going to come back out of here. And then we got Live Fights 1. This is where the pay-per-view is at. Live Fight 1 and Live Fight 2. He got replays on the bottom. You can catch an old Floyd Mayweather fight on the replays all the way on the bottom. And then if we had somebody fighting tonight, we come inside here. You'll see the main card will be inside here. And if you press on replays inside this Live Fight 1 category... You can get some replays as well as out there. All right, so we can see the Cotto and Canelo on the replay, the Ronda Rousey and the Holly Holmes. That's on replay as well, too. Then I'm going to back out of Dra uh, Dragon Streams. I'm going to skip on over to Sport Devil. These are two sport apps I know the most. And then I'm going down to Live Sports. That's over here in the top right-hand corner. Click on Live Sports. And then these are all sport links. I'm going to give you guys my favorite sport link. The favorite sport link I like the most is ATV.net and also FirstRoad.eu. Um, don't feel shy to go on all these. These are all live sport links. They do play every game in the world and also pay-per-view as well too. So I'm going to click on to this ATV.net. And then if you look down here, I got ESPN and then I got the Carolina Panthers and so on and so on. And all the games, these are all the NFL games. And they do play. Everything in here is crystal clear. 
um, or, not, or at least not even crystal clear, at least got to be like a standard definition type of um, imagery. But if you could look, this is what we're looking at right now. These are all the games are on. And I'm going to press out of here real quick, come back out of here, and I'm going to teach you guys a trick because um, they got two sport tabs, right? They got another sport tab over here. This is for, like, I guess more for, like, uh, college, college sports down here. Um, they got some poker and stuff like that and all sports and so on. All right, and then they got a kids kids zone over here that look pretty decent. I kind of like what they put together. Okay, and they got music over here as well. You do got your SoundCloud, your live concerts in here, mix radio. Um, you can go get your MP3s and so on. And then they got something though called the top. These are top movie apps that they have on here, which I believe they put them all in category and all they put them all in. The type of category it should be in. One channel is on the bottom. E Network, um, Genesis, Phoenix, NaviX, E Cloud, and uh, Salt. And so they got they pretty much, and they got some little more undermarked bookmarks over there. So they put the top ones over here, and they didn't put them there for a reason. They really mean they're the top apps to use. So make sure that you're using all the top applications. That's why they put them here, and so they the data top applications I actually use. Okay, and then they got some other add-ons down here on the bottom. Okay, and they got, some, got a bunch of movies going on right now. And they got maintenance over here. It's pretty much for news. They got a news section over here. Okay. All right. And they got something else, clear cache. You can hit that to clear the cache. All right. And I push yes, clear the cache. Got it done. Push okay. Uh, delete thumbnails, advanced settings, system info, and programs. All right, so they made things a little bit more different. They got a speed tester. You can take the speed test over here. And then they got something called Cowboy Curtis. You can click this Cowboy Curtis. Then they got quick support. Uh, so the person you bought your DigiStream unit from, you can use a quick support icon and actually go in there and get support. You can actually remote control access the box. And also you have EarthCam. You can pretty much look at a lot of things around the world. So, um, and also Cowboy Curtis, I think would be very detrimental that you look at Cowboy Curtis. Um, the reason why these are instructional videos, um, set up videos and they teach you some things here, how to clear, clear and reset Cody. This is very important. Um, I felt like I didn't have to make a DVD video about that. Um, Cowboy Curtis already explained it. Also how to connect to your network and how to set your date and time and weather. Um, and also change your TV size. So I say if you first purchase a DigiStream unit, um, I think you should go back and look at these videos for sure. Um, they're going to make a lot of sense for you and going to make your experience very well on a DigiStream unit. And I'm um, just going to come back down here and breeze into Genesis real quick. I, I like one channel. I'm going to put icing on the cake. The reason why I like one channel, and we go to movies over here, tap on movies. And you want to go to Featured. That's where all the new movies at. You can go to the other categories. And as you can look, you got the Featured movies that are in here. Mm -hmm. And then um, we come back out of here. We can go into Genesis real quick. We're going to go into some of the older movie apps that was around movies. Um, I click in theaters, tap in theaters. Okay. And then you got all the new movies out in the movie theater right now. But um, I'm just going to I'm going to stick me personal. I'm going to stick with Phoenix. I like what I seen. Um, I like Still, and um, I think Still kind of got it on lock right now when it comes to his movies. Um, they give you a little bit more. They come right on. The links are great. They can use the links real quick. And also, I'm gonna I'm gonna mess with this guy over here called Rock Crusher. Rock Crusher is pretty decent. And then um, also, I'm gonna fool around with the things they put here. Entertainment Hub. And also NaviX, and also C Cloud TV, and all streams. So whatever DigiStream put on the outskirts, that's what I'm going to use to make me to make me a professional on the box. And I'm going to teach you another trick. If we come back over here to sports, two sports. But if I press OK on sports, by the first one highlighted in blue, it brings up all the applications. So every app that you've seen. On the categories and the subcategories, they all here. So they got they put everything all right here for you. So you ain't missing a beat. Everything is in here. And then for your cable, um, I got your cable unlocked for you guys. 
This is all in alphabetical order. So we're looking for IPTV Stalker. And um, if you have problems getting in there, just give me a call. And I'm um, also, um, if you clear data and you actually go back and rerun the Digi Wizards, uh, give me a call because actually um, we unlocked it. But when you clear the data, you actually erase the um, codes we put inside there. So just give me a call back if you ever clear data. But if you got the box now, everything is working well, don't worry about clearing the data. Just remember to clear your cache. And um, that's it. I'm just going to sign off, guys. Uh, check the next video out. Um, if you guys want to purchase more units, make sure you get back at www.digiextreme.us. The link will be inside my bio. And also, for any questions, please make sure you reach out and give me a phone call. We'll take care of everything. All right, take care. God bless. Bye-bye.